What's going on guys? It's Minty here, back with another episode of Elder Souls. We just defeated a very frustrating nature beast slash stone golem fight. And it would appear that these tentacle things are gone now. Probably means we can interact with the stones. This might unlock the door for us. Such shrines were common in the great forest in the ancient times and were meant to ward the woods against evil. And yet this shrine seems to fall. Stone cracked and soaked in blood. Maybe I need to either use soul as an active wild hunt. Many were the rituals, shrines, and temples erected to, by, to the dear god deep within the great forest. Most believe that such honors originated from respect and worship. Only elders remember the truth, for if they've seen the great beast hunt and feast upon humans, they have witnessed its true form and indeed wish to not see it again. So either I gotta go speak to our dear friend here. Or there's some way I need to be able to do the things with the statues. Tablet tables. Hmm, I sense change in the forest. The old one is no more, and yet I can feel part of its spirit within you, child. And yet these woods remain corrupted. Sacred altars are spoiled and defiled. I fear only the power of the old one could have restored them. Yet the fragment you carry within yourself lacks the potency to cleanse them. If only there was... Hmm. A way to channel the energy of the old one. Okay. A way to channel the energy of the old one, you say. Hmm. It is kind of. I can do this. But I don't think that's what you meant. Um, let me go try it anyway. Nope. Okay. Well, I tried. I wonder... If I'm able to... Do anything by the Citadel again now. Because the forest is still defiled, but... Oh, look at that. The orb. Yep. That did just open. I'm gonna go chat to our little science friend again. Unless I'm able to get more vowels later on. Unless like as I progress I might find more. But for now, I've got all these items. There's not much I can do with them right now by the looks of it. It looks like I can always TP on back. Oh, that doesn't sound good at all. Stuck here now, it seems. What just happened? Something blew up. Read. Once upon a time, the Grace Forest ruled the in lands of the continent. After the First Crusade, its god was chained. And the great trees fell to the fire of working and workings of men, making way for fields, villages, and roads. A scholarly man notes that the trees within the great forest had the most peculiar of colors and decided to have a single sapling from the destruction. Save a single sapling. It is fitting then that such sapling would find its home within the citadel, where once the heart of the great forest stood. I don't know what flooding out of there. Oh, the harp. The harp guy is back. Id. You've chosen the darkest of paths, my friend. I'm afraid you won't take kindly to your new master. Surely not once he awakens fully and discards you like my companions here. I have nothing else to give you besides my pity. 
So should I not have bonded with the crows? No, 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 no. Hmm. So maybe I sh Maybe because I bonded with the crows, it changes the outcome of what's to come. Research log 0989. Unit 12 reporting final research log. Units 33, 34, and 35 have reported that the three gates have been sealed as instructed. Conduits of power have been reported to function at the proper rate and the sealing spells are working as expected. Unit 12 confirms that combat specimen 1 has been induced into hibernation to maintain its energy reserve and is guarding its allocated gate. Unit 12 regrets to note that combat specimen 2 is still roaming outside the walls and its retrieval was a failure. All the remaining units have been assembled at the steps of ascension and instructed. All watches units await further orders. Long live the creator. I don't want to go up there just yet, because I feel like either there might be more to it, or there might not be, but I just don't want to end up missing something. Probably already have missed some stuff, and maybe I made a mistake joining the crows. The end of times. Achievement. Hmm. Does that mean this is the end? Ooh. Temple of Ascension. I wonder... You gotta choose. So I wonder if you go absorb the light and you give it to the crow, that'll be one. So I wonder if you then rather go to Eos or the Ice Guy, you get a different one. That might, You might be able to... That probably is what you're supposed to do. You gotta choose which one you want to activate. Ooh. This looks like a little crow dude. Yo, oh, my health kind of just vanished. They like Eos, actually. Now that I, I oh, I dodged. I, I had a feeling doing that dodge would get me killed. Can I do anything to orbs? Sort of, yeah. I can. I can damage them instead. I don't think they'll take kindly to me doing that. Oh. Okay, so he's got a massive AOE. Steps on the floor. I don't know if it's worthwhile attacking the orbs rather or not. There goes all my health. But maybe if I'm lucky and I dodge a few moves, I can get it all back. Might be easier to attack them depending on what happens. What if I have to actually just attack him? Did I defeat him? Ah, uh, something's wrong. Oh, there goes all my souls, I think. I think he just took all my souls. Oh, I think he steals all your souls. Is this round two already? 
I'm actually not sure. I don't think so. Ah, uh, the pyro's on lips is definitely not round two. Trying to figure out if it's definitely. Oh, better get rid of that. I wonder what happens if you don't. Probably just gets you killed if you don't. Okay, so all in all, first phase isn't that bad. But phase two gets a little exciting. I wonder, depending on which covenant you take the. I think whatever covenant you end up taking the will probably kind of dictate your end game boss probably. I'm out of dodging again. What? I don't even know where I always spend it. <laughs> I wonder if it's better to go and fight them off in a corner somewhere. To get them a sort of out the way. So when they clump up, they become dangerous. Oh, I just stood in everything I could have. <laughs> oh, if there was something for me to stand in, I stood in it. how low my health actually was there. Eek. Always forget it doesn't matter, I can always dodge the attack anyway. I mean I don't have to Dodge the actual hit, circle, or anything like that. I didn't realize how quickly those circles go off one after the other. It's a good early game way to get some hits in. Oh, I just <laughs> I threw myself into that attack. A bit.
they can always dodge the hit itself, but it can be in the circle. Even. I'm technically much weaker in second phase. Because do I lose all my buffs? Or does it just steal my souls too? It doesn't look like I really lose my buffs. Oh, I see what's happening. Holy crap. Okay, so he takes your abilities and starts using them against you. Okay, I got caught off guard there. This floor suddenly lights up. The mechanic is so quick, I can't always see it. I wonder if this is because I chose the crow path. Okay, so I don't lose my powers, he just uses them against me. And I didn't realize that until I got wrecked that fight. I can't move! Is there a third phase? It almost looks like it. Woo! 
So you constantly have to rely on your life steal in that last fight. That was intense. I'm guessing there's more than one ending because of the boss vials that you can consume. And let the old and let the gods of old be consumed and forgotten. Hail the eldest son, awakened at last. Yeah. Well, I guess that's the first ending. Because I'm assuming each uh, of the elements that you decide to absorb will enhance. New game plus. The cycle begins, uh, will change the end boss. You will keep your progress and continue strengthening your shards and gain more talent points. Be wary, however, as your foes may have gotten new and stronger attacks since the last time you faced them. And the curse of the elders become ever more stronger. Curse of the elders. 15% damage taken. Minus 10% health received. Plus 220% enemy HP. You? Yeah. Okay, so new game plus is gonna be something. Alright guys, I think with that we'll call it there. Ending one new game cycle completed. If I am correct on the bosses, because I've never googled it or anything. I haven't done any research to try and find any. I'd like to try and see if I'm right or wrong. So depending on the energy you absorb, whether you go to the ice boss, the light boss, or the chaos, looks like it affects your end boss possibly, or your end path. But yeah, thank you for watching guys, hope you enjoyed the journey, it wasn't too long so far, and uh, as if you enjoyed the video, consider liking and subscribing, and as always, till the next one.